In this Jasper review, I'm going to show you everything you need to know about AI writing. If you have any questions, please comment them down below, and I'll also be sure to leave a discounted link down there so you can get your money's worth for Jasper. Jasper is a software which includes an AI writing assistant. This is what you should see once you have logged in. We're gonna quickly go through all of the features that Jasper includes. And then once we've gone over the main dashboard, we will dive deeper into each feature. So straight off the bat, up in the top left hand corner here, this is the Jasper logo. If you were to click on that, it should take you to the main page. Right below that, we have the project section. If you click on this, it should open up the project section. Right here, you can either have a demo or a personal project. And then all the way below that, you can see all of your projects or even start a new project. For this review, we're gonna go over most of the templates that Jasper has to offer. As you can see here on the templates section, there is a huge variety of AI writing templates that you can choose from. We're gonna quickly read through a few of these. So you can either choose to write a document, let Jasper help you with writing longer articles from start to finish. You can have an Amazon product feature right here. Create key feature and benefit bullet points for Amazon listings under the about item section. You can also have blog post topic ideas, brainstorm new blog post topics that will engage readers and rank well on Google, or other things like Facebook and Google ads. So as you can see overall, Jasper has a huge variety of templates for the AI writing system that it includes. So starting off, we're actually gonna go ahead and click one of these templates so that we can run through each feature. We're gonna just go with the Amazon product description up here, create compelling product descriptions for Amazon listings. The output is typically a paragraph form, but the style will vary. So once you click on that, you should end up on this page. So right here, you can see the product name. This right here is where you type the product name. Then below that, you can see the key benefits or features. This is where you type in any features that you'd want to include within the generation. And then below that, you have your tone of voice. So you can style how you actually want the words to be formed within the sentences. Finally, below that, you have your language options. You can change it from an input language to a different output language if you wish. We're gonna go ahead and just keep it with English to English. All the way at the bottom down here, you can either clear the inputs once you have inputted them in. To the right of that, you can actually change how many outputs are generated. And then finally, to the right of that, once you have inputted everything, you can generate your output. So we're gonna go ahead and click over here and actually type a product name, just a random one off the top of my head so I can show you the features. So there you go, I just went ahead and typed in gaming PC. This was the first thing off the top of my head. So that is our product name. However, your product name would usually have an actual name for it, but we don't have an actual product name. So we're just writing in the product itself. Below that now we're gonna move on to the key benefits or features. So I'm just gonna write three to five different features so they can get inputted to the system. So there you go, I have next wrote in the key benefits and features for our gaming PC. I wrote fast paced, high quality, great connection, and it has one terabyte of storage. Next, we're gonna move on to the tone of voice section. Now for a gaming PC, we're gonna wanna go with something professional rather than witty, which it has an option to choose here so there you go i just wrote in professional so we can get a professional output for our product once you've filled in all of this information again down here at the bottom you want to go ahead and click generate and there you go once it has generated it should output all of this information and it should all correlate with the inputs you inputted in the left hand section so up here at the top as you can see you can either copy this you can either open it in a document you can upvote it if you like it, or you can downvote it if you don't like it. So we're gonna go ahead and quickly read through these just to make sure they are what we expected. Introducing the gaming PC, a high quality desktop computer that's perfect for gamers who demand the best performance. This machine is built for speed with a fast processor and high-end graphics card that will let you play the latest games at their highest settings. As you can see so far, some of this information we didn't even type in. We just put high quality and fast paced, and it's came out with all of its own information AI generated. That's a pretty cool feature on Jasper if I do say so myself. It also has a great connection with multiple ports that let you plug in all of your gaming peripherals. Again, we only put in great connection to the left. However, it has came out with multiple ports which I did not type in whatsoever. Plus, it comes with one terabyte of storage so you can save all your games and files on one device. 
audio gaming PC today and get ready to experience the ultimate gaming experience. There you go, Jasper AI is absolutely excellent. The majority of that I actually didn't even write in. The AI actually generated it itself and it all fitted and actually correlated with our product and the features that we actually inputted. If I was listing a product on Amazon, I would go ahead and click this one and copy it right up here like we said, and I would use this description without a doubt. So now back to the templates page, we're gonna go ahead and try this again. We're gonna make sure it works for a second time and we're gonna go ahead and try it with a different template so we can actually run through the different features that each template has on Jasper. Next, we're gonna go for a business or product name. Generate a winning name for your business or product. Once you click on that, it should take you to this page, which looks exactly like the other page that we have just been on. However, there are less options to choose from here, so it should be a more simple process. At the top, you can tell them about your business or product and you would write that in right below it. And then below that, you have keywords to include to tell them what you would want to include. Below that, you have the language options again, which we are going to keep the same. Right, so I'm going to go ahead and type in a business or a product now. So the AI can actually come up with a name. And there we go. I quickly wrote a business or a product description. Car pickup business that uses an app to order and pick up customers. They input their location and pay on the app. Then the driver picks them up and takes them to that location. This is kind of like Uber, but hopefully we don't actually get an AI generated name, which is Uber. We want a different name so we don't get copyrighted. We're not actually going to include any keywords just so we can see what the AI system actually generates on its own accord. So once we've done all that, we're going to go ahead and click generate. And there we go. We have generated our outputs. Now, at first glance, these aren't actually good outputs. We've got my car, my driver, we've got one, and then Uber me, which we do not want because it includes Uber. The AI system is kind of faulty on this one. I don't know if I would use this if I need to come up with a business name. Let's go ahead and click generate again, just so we can see if it actually works a second time. There we go, it's generated three more names. Ride seeker, car pickup, get me, get me now or get me there. Most of these are not really good. Ride seeker is all right. I would consider choosing that. However, the rest are completely bad. So if we don't want any of these names, we're gonna go ahead and just click clear up in the top right and it should clear your section. Finally, back at the templates page, we're gonna go with a third template just to finish it off and see what features we want. We're going to go with the Google ads description, create high converting copy for the description section of your Google Ads. Once you click on that, it should take you to this page. Again, has all the same features as the other two templates. You have your company slash product name, company description, tone of voice. However, this time it does have some examples. We're gonna go ahead and fill in this information really quickly so we can see if Jasper does generate some good Google Ads descriptions. And there we go, we have wrote in all of the descriptions that we want for this AI output. So I went ahead with a company name and called it Lift Up. We're gonna go with a gym-based app. And then the product description, a gym app that helps people get into shape and train their body. It's easy and free to use. The food tracking system and diet plan makes eating healthy easier than ever. It also has templates for gym plans. So a quick and easy, simple gym app is what we will be outputting. I went ahead and made the tone of voice professional again, and we're not going to add any examples just to see how the AI fares for itself. Now we're going to go ahead and click generate. And here we go. It has generated Google ads description, 14 day free trial install in minutes sign up today 100 percent risk free this is a decent google description not too much going on but it does use the key features that i did type in the product description or we could go with gym app free for seven days easily track your diet and exercise with over 90 templates that is another decent one free turn-based workouts over 100,000 users that one is a bit boring i do like the first two though so there you go the google ads description does work decently well it comes up with what you need and includes the information from what you typed in in the input section. Once you've finished with all that though, you can go ahead and clear. And then if you actually want to generate again, you just go ahead and click generate down here and it should generate more. And there you go, that is the Jasper review for the AI writing system. Overall, I think it is very well made and very well configured for this software. A few of the features I like about this software is that it actually does generate the inputs that you put into the input section and all of the outputs do correlate well with what you want. 
However, some of the templates don't actually work properly, or maybe they just lack some creative aspect. Again, since the business or product name section didn't actually create a good business name. Would I recommend this to anyone? Yes, I would, absolutely. As I said, the AI is very well configured, and I think it works great overall. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.